Cancer, hello, welcome. Let's jump right in here and see what's going on with who you're... <laughs> Cancer, who you're dealing with tomorrow. Come back tomorrow. <laughs> Sorry, I had to. <laughs> Sorry. You know what I mean? Beetlejuice, Beetlejuice, Beetlejuice today, Cancer. So I'm going to be goofy. So hopefully you like goofiness. But anyway, okay, uh, tomorrow, Cancer, um, I'll tell you about who you're dealing with. But today it's going to be about you, okay, Cancer? Um... But go to my husband's uh, tarot, speaking of, yeah, go to my husband's tarot channel for, to get answers about who you're dealing with. Um, why are you make me forget? Possess 777. <laughs> Maybe I'm getting goofy here. Okay, but anyway, yes, so Cancer, hello. It's a general reading for you. Of course, it's not going to resonate with all of you, but for more readings after this, please go ahead and check out my husband's tarot channel. I already mentioned it. At Possess 777, I'll do it again. Shameless plug-in, but not so shameless at the same time. Don't care. He's my husband. <laughs> and then... Um, I do offer same-day personal readings. Everything you need to know is in the description box below. Thank you, Kansa. Kansa, Kansa. Let's see what you are up to today. Sorry, hold on. That almost went him up my nose. Ew. Okay. Anyway, my costumes come alive as time goes on. I swear they start to like really start to really feel like the character here. Okay. So, Cancer, you have realized you don't care no more in a good way. Like you do not care to deal with people, places, and things that just aren't for you anymore. You have stumbled upon someone or something that's extremely toxic for you. You yourself realize maybe you were involved in something that could have been toxic, but at the same time, you're getting rid of it. You're done with it. Like you don't have time for that or them or whatever it is. You understand it's better off if you just emotionally disconnect and walk away and live your life. And that's what you're doing here. And so you're heeding the warning. Maybe you saw something or maybe you're going through whatever, you know, or dealing with certain people. And then you got your own like sign and synchronicity being like, oh, wait a minute. No, this is not, well, no, this is not good. And so you decided to deal with that, how you did here and basically kind of understand and accept that warning and actually work with it and not get yourself in any more issues or problems. You're getting yourself out of it, which is really nice. Let's see more here. Yeah. And so it looks like here that you are focused now on making plans, very motivated with these plans here. Okay. And they're plans for you and you only, but also for some of you, it could be that you're romantically interested in someone and you're ready to approach them. Okay. Which is really cool here. Others of you, these plans really get you to a point where you understand yourself more and better now you're like excited to create and do what you need to do, okay? And very loving and friendly to others and, you know, friends, people, whoever you hang out with. Let's see more here. Yeah, I feel like honestly, some of you have made a choice on who you want to be with or if you are with them. There is a connection here. And I do get the sense that too, this is also you individually though. You are making an emotional choice in a beautiful, happy way to choose someone or something. You're no longer confused anymore, okay? Maybe you used to be, but now it's at a point where it's like, there's no need for confusion. You now know exactly who or what to choose in your life right now at this time. Yeah, and that is helping you get to a point where you are really becoming a lot more, um, you know, equal with others around you and with yourself, fair, equal exchanges, being kind to yourself and others. 
And really though, it's you moving forward on a beautiful path and journey for you. It's really you doing what it is that you need to do for yourself. So anything or anyone that's been toxic for you, you're just, you're moving on from all of that. You're leaving that toxic baggage wherever it may have been, wherever you found it basically here in the situation. Okay. Let's see more here. Yeah, yeah. And so because of this, because you're on an amazing healing journey, you are gaining a realistic perspective of how things were and how things are now. And you're realizing now it's, 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 I don't know, it's kind of like, it's not that you were ever dumb or ignorant or like stupid or uneducated. It's because of energies and people and shitty toxic situations that you finally are removing yourself from that now you're like, wait a minute, I, I, can, I can memorize things. And hold on, actually, I understand now. You peep shit. But you've been peeping stuff, Cancer. You're a peeper. You peep You peep in silence. You're the person that doesn't say one damn thing. You see some shady shit, you're like, oh, word. Okay. <laughs> like, you sit with it. Like, poker face it. And so the cool thing at 1111, if that means anything for you, um, you know, divine and blessed Cancer is what you are. I see here that you now have an awareness of understanding what's going on in your life. So you're a lot more cool, calm, and reserved in the situation. And that has helped you to realize what or who else were burdens or stress that you no longer need to deal with and you're dropping them, okay? You're like, I don't have time for this. Very nice, Cancer. Beautiful, yeah. And you're a lot more happier now and way more intuitive. You now know what it means to trust your intuition. It's very beautiful here. Actually, I'm going to write that down for you because I really like that. Because that's exactly what it is. It's like you're so much happier now because it's like a sense of understanding and knowing there's no confusion. It's kind of like you feel it. Cool. You're feeling weird off from it. Uh-uh. Like you're like, no, no, thanks. That's not it for me. I'm not. You know what I mean? It's like now you know how to navigate yourself in any way, shape or form and your emotions. And it's very, you know, it's just really nice. It's very positive and it makes you very happy. This new journey, this chapter, this beginning here for you. All right. And that's what I have for you. You could be dealing with, if you're dealing with anyone, uh, Virgo, Taurus, Capricorn, Gemini, Libra, Aquarius, Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio, Aries, Leo, Sagittarius. Thank you. Bye.